As the Tragically Hip's final tour rolled into London on Monday, the London Free Press was able to review a legal agreement between the CBC and community groups that are seeking to air publicly a screening of the final concert, which will be on CBC on August 20th. That concert will, of course, take place in the band's hometown, Kingston. And for longtime Tragically Hip fans, the good news is the, the contract is very fan-friendly and uh, should come as a great relief and no surprise to people who love the hip. The contract, which you can sign to show the concert uh, in a public place, and two London organizations are doing that. Tourism London is doing it at the London Music Hall, and the city is actually running a separate event at the nearby Victoria Park band shell that night. It includes wording like, it's about the fans, not the money, so you can't charge any admission to your screening. There can be no advertising. Uh, interestingly, it says you can't refer to this as the final or last Tragically Hip concert. Quote, unquote, we are aiming for a spirit of celebration for the broadcast, and that is important to the band. Of course, as major hip fans know, uh, lead singer Gord Downey is struggling with uh, terminal brain cancer, and this will almost certainly be the final tour of the band. They arrive in London Monday night at Budweiser Gardens, and the tour wraps up August 20th in Kingston, and fans will have the ability to watch it with hundreds of others, either at Victoria Park or at the London Music Hall. Uh, and it won't cost the public a dime, thanks to the Tragically Hip and the CBC's contract uh, that I reviewed today. Uh, and that will come as no surprise to people who have loved this band since they first hit the big time in Canada in 1987. On behalf of the London Free Press and LFPress.com, I'm Tragically Hip fanatic Patrick Maloney.